if you're making 10 to $30,000 per month in your coaching business right now, can you imagine taking a quantum leap into $100,000 months within the next three to six months? You see, if you said yes, then congratulations, you're already halfway there. If you said no, then let me help you understand the concept of taking a quantum leap. In quantum physics, it is defined as a sudden change from one energy state to another within an atom. When you search it on Google, it will say a sudden increase or an abrupt change in a state. Benjamin Hardin wrote a book called 10x is easier than 2x and inside of it he said that it is way easier to 10x your business than it is to 2x it because when you're thinking about doubling your business you will be seeing a lot of different options showing up you can literally double down on your time that you're investing in your business you can double down on the uh, traffic that you're sending to your funnels you can double down on the sales calls that you're taking but when you really sit down to think about different ways you can 10x your business at the same time then you will run out of options because you cannot literally 10x the time that you're investing. You cannot literally 10x the number of sales calls that you're doing because again, it's going to take a lot of time, right? You see, when we first did our challenge with our first challenge client, he at the time he was making $5,000 per month. When we executed the five day challenge for him, he ended up making $160,000 in revenue in just five days with collecting over $55,000 in cash, right? that is an 11 X increase in cash collection. How much time did it take? It took us two months during the transition. That is what is called a quantum leap, right? So for the past few days, I have been stressing you on doing five day challenges. I absolutely get it. But if you have no idea what I'm talking about, then think of five day challenges as a five day virtual event where you bring in a group of people inside of a zoom room and you deliver value for one hour every single day for five days straight. And then you dedicate another one hour right after a training to go ahead and answer the questions of people. They're going to come into the Zoom room and ask you questions right in the Zoom, right? So you answer those questions. Towards the end of those five days, you go ahead and soft pitch your coaching program offer, right? When you do that, some of those people who are listening to you are going to buy into your coaching program. As simple as this, right? So today I'm going to take two scenarios and plan out your quantum leap journey for you. So make sure you watch till the end so that you do not miss out any of those, right? So let's take the first scenario. This first scenario is where you do not have any results and you haven't made any money through your coaching business yet, right? Now, when I'm talking about you having no results, what I'm really saying is that you haven't worked with a few clients to coach them on something and they have gotten some results from your coaching, right? Now, um, I absolutely understand you are in your industry for a while now, or maybe you are just uh, getting into a new niche and you have no results inside of it, right? So here's what you can do in order to take like a quantum leap inside of your business right off the gate, right? So let me introduce you to the concept of doing free challenges. Free challenges, it, it, it is like, again, a virtual event, a five day virtual event, but you do not charge them, your um, attendees any, any money to get them and come in, uh, and see you speak for five days inside of your five day challenge, right? So you deliver pure value for free. But here's the trick. When you're doing a five day challenge, the entry ticket is free, but you introduce another ticket, which is going to cost $47 for people to come up and ask you questions, right? So this is called a VIP ticket. So there are two tickets over here. One is for free, which is general admission. And the second one is a VIP experience, right? If the VIP experience, people get to ask you questions after the training is complete for each day. Now, when you're doing a free challenge, what you're simply doing is you're giving your audience or uh, the attendees who are joining the challenge an experience of your coaching program before you pitch your coaching program in the first place. You see, when you are just starting out inside of a new niche or you're getting into a coaching business, you do not, you do not have a premium value right off the gate, like premium value offer, right? Rather than having a premium value offer and charging $10,000 for your coaching program right off the gate, think of different ways you can create a case study. You can create a group of case study clients first, right? I have already talked about case study clients before. You can go ahead and watch um, uh, this video over here and uh, it will give you an idea about why case study clients are very important. But, but case study clients are those people, a small group of people who you are going to personally work with one-on-one -on -one to help them get you uh, get the results that you're promising. So for example, you're a sales coach and you help people um, uh, like increase the conversion rates on calls, like close rates. And uh, you, you help them go from 10% close rate to 50% close rate. You're a sales coach, right? 
but now you're just stepping into the coaching industry you have done sales before but now you this is the first time you're stepping into a coaching industry you cannot charge someone ten thousand dollars right off the gate right because even if you have the results have you coached it to someone else now i have made the same mistake i wouldn't recommend you make the same mistake and at the end you go ahead and refund all of these people if you do not get them to the results you see doing it yourself is one thing and then coaching it to others is another thing right so rather than doing that create a beta group of people like again those case study clients and charge 997 dollars for people to join that beta group in exchange for a video testimonial or as they say to them that i'm going to help you on this i'm going to coach you on this to help you get to this particular result uh, at 997 dollars provided you provide me with an interview like you allow me to do an interview with you when you get to the results like as simple as that so these become your case study clients you see once you have gotten all of these results you can go ahead and increase your price i'm going to talk about that right but in the free challenge itself you go ahead and introduce like um tell people about your beta program on day five right when you do that some of the people you're going to get your first set of case study clients within your first challenge okay so how do you fill up the challenge let me talk about how you can um, fill up that particular free challenge it's very simple right right now you do not have an audience let's say you do not have a social presence and so on and so forth but here's here's a trick you can create those case study client without any of it simply start running ads right run ads to your uh, challenge funnel where upfront the challenge is free and then you upsell them the vip ticket right once they sign up for the free challenge you upsell them the vip ticket saying they can get the recordings of the full five day challenge Plus, they will get an extra hour with you for the next five days, like um, an hour each day for five days uh, to to be able to ask you questions. Now, this will uh, this will incentivize them to go ahead and sign up for the forty seven dollar VIP ticket, right? Now, when this happens, you are going to liquidate the money that you are putting on in the advertisements. Now, there is this math that I have that we have proven that works is that if one hundred people are signing up on your free challenge, around twenty percent of that, like uh 20 people of them are going to buy your vip ticket so your vip ticket is 47 dollars so 940 dollars um your 940 dollars you are going to make um when those 20 people sign up in as a vip experience right if you spend 1000 and let's just say that in order to get one person in uh inside of your program inside of your challenge you you ha- you are spending around 10 dollars right so all together you are just spending 60 dollars to get those 100 people in but guess what you have gotten the name email address and phone number and now you can contact them get them back on to the next challenge without having to spend a dime so now you own the audience as well right so you have spent 60 dollars to get 100 people's list uh, that you can market to over and over again okay that's a whole different scenario but you you go ahead and do the challenge and let's just say five people invest inside of your beta program five of those people invest you go ahead and give your best work with them one on one to get them to the results that you are prom- promising inside of your industry inside of your niche right you work hard get them to the results and once you do that you will be ready to go into the next level or the next scenario where you have gotten the results and you are making close to 10 to 30000 dollars per month consistently and now you are ready to do what is called a paid challenge right now when do you like what is the point where you will be thinking that okay i am ready for this right uh, how much money you should be making at the point before doing paid challenges you see it really depends uh, it really depends on when you can raise your price right i have already talked about how you can uh, set up the pricing of your coaching programs inside of this particular video right go ahead and watch this video so that you can understand how to price your coaching programs but Honestly, whenever you are, whenever uh, you're deciding the price of your coaching program, it really depends on the value that you're providing to your audience or your coaching business clients, right? So, how does that work? Now, by value, I mean what, what kind of money um, uh, that the person, your coaching client, will be making or saving when they work with you, right? Once you decide that, once you see that going up, 
you know that it is time for me to raise my prices. So let me give you an example of the same coach that I was talking about, like the closer. So for example, you are a sales coach and you help people go from 10% close rate to 50% close rate. And that, yeah, that has increased the conversions of your clients. Um, and in commissions, you, it has increased to like $10,000, right? So right now you are charging $997 for that particular program. But this client of yours is making $10,000 per month consistently, right? So that is like $120,000 a year of additional revenue that your client is making because of you, right? So now you know that if you work with a client, you can get them to a hundred to make an extra $100,000 a month, like $100,000 a year, right? So for that, you can charge 10% of, uh, of that amount that you are giving to your clients. Now, that is $10,000. Now you're ready to increase your price only when your clients start getting those kind of results. So when they do that, when you have raised your price beyond $5,000, you're ready to do paid challenges, right? Because you see, once you have gotten all of these case studies, once you have gotten the results, now your motive should be to only work with premium clients to go from five case studies to hundred case studies. When you go to hundred case studies over there, you can just go go like uh, all in on scaling your business right but until 100 100 um, case studies come in start doing paid challenges so that you only bring in serious people to work with yet increasing your uh, increasing your revenue and taking a quantum leap into six figure uh, like six figure months right so how you can do that what are paid challenges for real you see paid challenges are very similar to free challenges rather than um, giving people the ticket for free you charge for it so the general admission over here in paid challenges also has a price. So it's for 97 general admission, VIP experience comes for $297. And then we introduce another experience over here, which is platinum experience. And we sell it for $597, right? Now the people who invest in the platinum experience are your most ideal clients because we have seen 95% of the platinum experience people who join our client challenges show up on the challenge. You see, when you're doing free challenges, the show up rate is going to be 5%, right? 5% of the people who invest inside, of, who, who get inside of the uh, challenge are going to show up for the challenge. But in a paid challenge, the, the show up rate is so, so high because they have made an investment in, investment in that, themselves, right? Now, here's an amazing thing. When you're doing free challenges first, you have mastered the challenge, like the five day challenge, you have mastered the material, you know what questions people are asking, you have already made or altered the uh, presentations and you have done all of that. And now you you have a winning challenge, the conversion is happening and all of that. Now, when you do a paid challenge, right, you know that it is going to convert because you have, you have already been proving it all of this while, right? So the key over here is to do a challenge every single month rather than doing it quarterly or annually right? Do a challenge every single month. So when you're doing the paid challenge, um, you bring people in, you do the same challenge trainings that you are doing in the free challenges. And then you simply go ahead and pitch your premium value offer towards the end of the challenge. And for us, we have seen conversions at 5% up to 40% of the people inside of the five day challenge, um, in the platinum experience as well, because you see the people who pay $697 to be on the five day challenge, they will be, they, they have the money to pay you uh, $10,000 for your premium value offer as well. Right? So you get more serious people when you start doing paid challenges. Now, how do you fill a room with paid challenges? You see, this is a all different, um, series that I can create because there are 11 different ways that you can um, fill up a paid challenge. But I'm going to talk about just two in this particular video so that you go home with a plan, right? So the first thing you can do to fill up this paid challenge is to go ahead and start doing weekly webinars, right? Now, rather than doing free challenges, you're doing free webinars and all week you're filling up the webinar through running ads, right? So let's say it takes $10 to fill up the webinar room now for, to get one person to register for a webinar. And then you do the webinar, 100 people register, 20, uh, 35, 35, 40 people are going to show up. And from that five to six people are going to join your paid challenge. You only sell your platinum ticket in there. Doing this every single week will help you fill up your challenge. By investing more, you will be getting more and more people to sign up inside of your challenge. But unlike a free challenge, where you have like 100 people, you are making $5,000. If you are having 100 people inside of a paid challenge, you're going to make way more 
than five thousand dollars you see let me give you an example one of our clients who was um uh, who had like 23 23 people on his first challenge made around twenty three thousand dollars like with just 23 people inside of it we increased it on his fourth challenge 150 people joined the challenge and out of those 150 people like um around 40 of them in made an investment to go ahead and work with us after uh, the challenge was complete in the premium value offer of our client guess how much money we made inside of it four hundred and forty thousand dollars right by simply having 150 people inside of our challenge you think you see that is the power of doing paid challenges right so weekly webinars you do weekly webinars fill up the room with platinum members only right that's how you get major majority of the people in the challenge as platinum members by simply selling the platinum ticket in the webinar and then the second thing you can do to fill up the room is by doing podcasts you see my coach uh, does a challenge every single month as well and um, he's a business coach so when he does a challenge every single month two years ago he uh, he got on this podcast with uh, one of his students and his student was like had around 500 600 thousand dollars thousand subscribers on his youtube channel at the time right when he interviewed this coach a uh, coach of mine that video blew up right it blew up like crazy hundreds and thousands of people had watched that video uh, when that happened he had uh, shared about the challenge in that podcast right people can join that particular challenge and the and the host of the podcast put the link in the description till date even after two years people are joining in inside of a challenge from that one podcast episode that is the power of doing podcasts like do more and more podcasts invest in getting on podcasts right when you get on those podcasts share your challenge offer your platinum ticket offer and get people to join in from uh, that particular podcast you never know which one of those podcasts is going to blow up and that is going to become an evergreen um, evergreen way of, of filling up your challenge right so that will instantly take you from 10 to thirty thousand dollars per month to hundred thousand dollar month okay that is how you take a quantum leap into hundred thousand dollar month by simply doing challenges okay um now you really understand how easy it is to do the challenges right i mean it's very simple think of it as a trial of your coaching business you do a great job on your five day challenge in delivering the value you are guaranteed to make um, make a lot of sales inside of it and you are ready to take quantum leaps now let me ask you this question if you think that challenges are so powerful now that you have understood so much in detail about it when are you doing yours